Thank you, Dr. Jacobs. This is actually our 16th year to do military commissioning at the same time as graduation. I'm also Colonel Snyder, United States Air Force uh, Medical Corps retired. The, this commissioning ceremony is a time-honored tradition. It signifies a new officer joining the profession of arms. It's also the visible transformation of student to officer just as commencement ceremony is a recognition of transformation from student to physician. So this is a, a double big day for these individuals. The oath of office is administered to every new officer as they swear to, to support and defend the Constitution of the United States. And as such, each newly commissioned officer becomes an agent of the executive branch of the government appointed by the president. The pinning of the rank is a visible sign of this appointment and of the commitment made by this, these officers. These physicians will be entering the proud service of their country as a military medical officer, taking care of all of our active duty members and all of their families back home. And they, some of these individuals, no doubt, will likely be deployed in support of combat missions in the upcoming future. So at this point in time, I'd like to start with the Air Force commissioning, and I'd like to invite Drs. Davey, Gill, Nickel, Roberts, Sanford, Meinhardt, and Walker to come on up to the stage. I ask them to switch this direction because they are now facing the American flag. So we're gonna go ahead and raise your right hand. I and state your name. Having been appointed an officer in the United States Air Force, do solemnly swear or affirm that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I take this obligation freely, without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion, and that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties of the office upon which I am about to enter. So help me God. Congratulations. And now if you would go ahead and go ahead and space out and then I'd like to invite the family forward. And we have um, we have family members that are actually pinning on the rank. Today, for Captain Davey, his wife, Bree Davey, will pin on the rank. For Captain Howard Gill, his father, Lieutenant Colonel Howard Gill III, will pin on his rank. For Captain Nickel, his wife, Shannon Nickel, and mother, Lori Wissinger, will pin on their rank. And for Captain Wesley Roberts, Father Terry Roberts, for Captain Summer Sanford Meinhardt, her husband, Kyle Meinhardt, and her father, Raleigh Hunter Sanford, and for Captain Derek Walker, his grandparents, Glenda Goodwin and Russell Goodwin, Sergeant U.S. Army, will also pin on their rank.
if I could have a round of applause for these new captains. And now I'd like to invite up our Army contingent, and that's soon to be Captains Macias, Reeves, and Walton. <clears throat> Gentlemen, if you would raise your right hand. I state your name. Having been appointed an officer, in the Army of the United States, do solemnly swear or affirm that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I take this obligation freely without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion, and that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties of the office upon which I am about to enter. So help me God. Congratulations. And now if I could ask their family to come forward. These new captains are going to be pinned on by their family. Captain Macias has his wife, Christine, and his son, Ryder, and his parents, Ramon Macias and Olga Macias, pinning on his ranks. Captain Reeves will have his wife, Nancy Kreitz, to do his rank, and Captain Walton is joined by Stephanie Walton to pin on his rank. And again, a round of applause for these new captains and doctors. And next, we're going to do Navy commissioning. And I will invite soon-to-be Lieutenants Boysen and Tedford. I like to always comment that the Navy does things differently. Uh, Lieutenant is the equivalent rank of captain in the other branches. So if you would raise your right hand, I state your name. Having been appointed an officer in the United States Navy, do solemnly swear or affirm that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I take this obligation freely without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion, and that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties of the office upon which I'm about to enter, so help me God. Congratulations. Great. And also their families will be coming up. Lieutenant Boysen is being pinned on by Taylor Boysen, her mother, Joanna Taylor, and her father, Lane Taylor. And Lieutenant Tedford by her sister, Kathleen Tedford Day, and her brother-in-law, Philip Day.
and congratulations to these new Navy lieutenants. And now, if the brass band would play for us the military medley. Thank <laughs> you. 